hey, I want a job. I want factory jobs. I don't, I don't want stuff made overseas, period, period. I don't want it. I've had enough of it. I want everything to be made here. And that's what you want me to do? Regardless of consequences and all like that, that's what we want you to do, regardless of consequences. We'll take the consequences. We'll deal with that later. But this is what we want done. We want it done now. Okay. That means no business overseas. That means you're going to have some problems now with people overseas. You're going to have some problems throughout the world with our allies and all like that. I tell them all the downside with the information I have available, and they say, hey, we're going for it. Then I say, okay. And if I believe that that's the best way to go about doing things too, in other words, I have to believe in what I'm doing in order to do an excellent job, then I would just go for it. It all comes down to satisfying people's wants. Now, if within a racial context, if being if I was a black person running for president, either for the first term or the second term, and even not only the president but governor or anything like that, I would ask the majority of the people who would be white, uh, what do you want? where black people are concerned. And what do you don't want? What is it you don't want? In all areas of activity, where black people are concerned, what do you want in economics? For them or not for them? What do you want when it comes to education, the school situation? What kind of school system should you, should you think that I should endorse for the black people where it comes to all of their education? educational funding and all this. What is it you want? The majority of the people, white people. See, I definitely want their opinion first. I'll get to the black people's opinions after that because what the majority of the white people want for black people is what's going to be, what's going to happen. And try to get them to tell the truth because that's very difficult to do when it comes to racial issues to get the average white person in 2012 to stand up and say, when it comes to black people, this is what I believe. 